My name is Lorraine and I help people live with passion, purpose and positivity. Welcome to my channel. I'm Lorraine and I help people live with passion, purpose and positivity and I give you tools to help you do that and I've got many tools up my sleeve and this one, this video is called Allow In The Magic. The magic being the synchronicities that come when you're in this state. There's certain things you've got to do and which many people don't do and I'm going to explain the steps to get you into that state where you can allow in the magic. I mean, that's what we all want, isn't it? We want the magic to happen. We want our lives to be fulfilled and happy and we want all our desires to manifest, don't we? So let's dive right into this video, Allow In The Magic. So when, when we've got a desire or when we want something, I've done it myself and I know a lot of people do it, they try and their ego, which it means edging God out, it's that lower part of yourself, is trying to control that thing that you want. You're trying to manifest it and you're doing everything about it and you're having all these negative thoughts about why isn't it coming, where is it? And what you're doing is you're stopping it from coming because once you understand that when you ask, it's always given every single time we live in this universe that's controlled by divine energy and you have a desire and you you set the intention for the desire you feel elevated emotions about that desire and and the the wheels of of creation are set in motion with the law of attraction and you know and that happens every single time and that is not woo woo wishy washy stuff that I'm talking about this is exact this is exact science it's atoms it's waves and particles and it's physics it's now been proven so be assured that whatever you're asking for is on its way it's on its way and you've got to trust the universe that it is on its way but we don't do we we take score we try and do things to to make things happen but that's the wrong way to do it. You set your intention and you get elevated emotion about your, your desire. Let's say it's a car. You say, I want that red Porsche. That red Porsche is mine. I love that red Porsche. You feel excited. You may go to the, to the garage to drive the Porsche or even sit in it and you get excited. You smell, smell the leather. You get all, in, you know, all, all excited and enthusiastic because you know it's on the way. And then you take, when you've done that, you take inspired action. But the inspired action comes from when you're feeling of a high vibration. So when you're worrying about it, when you're worrying about it, it's not coming, if you're thinking about the money to buy it, you're putting a, a block down on, on that coming. You're putting a block down. So what you've got to do is you've got to have the desire, feel the elevated emotion, do that several times a day. And what you'll find is the energy will just rush through you, you'll get excited. And that then accelerates the manifestation of it coming to you. And you've also, you've got to let go of the how. It's the universe's job for, for how it comes, not your job. Your job is to set the intention, to feel the elevated emotion. And then you follow the synchronicities that come. You know, you might see something on the telly that says, oh, the red Porsche. And then there's a number there. And then you ring, maybe ring the number up. You know, and that, and that feels good. But you can always tell whether you're on the right path. Does it feel good or not? If it doesn't feel good, it's not inspired action. You're blocking the manifestation from coming. And I'm going to put a picture of the Hawkins um, scale of consciousness. And this scale of consciousness will help you to, to know what, what vibration you're on. And it starts with like fear, anger and all these low, low vibration emotions. And then you go up the scale to enlightenment and love and everything like that. 
but most people are hovering sort of in the well a lot of people are sort of like a, of the lower vibration they're worrying about things and they're struggling and they're working hard but you set you you get yourself up this emotional scale and i'll put i'll put a, another picture of this hawkins scale of conscious consciousness at the end i'll also put a list of abraham's um emotional scale which is similar and your your job is to to get yourself up this emotional scale and how do you do that you follow your passion you follow your passion every single day you you follow your passion you get in you're getting excited about what you love doing and then your desire will come easier because you haven't got the resistance you know, the resistance, the energetic resistance. And this is the only reason things aren't coming to you. You can allow in that magic. And it's, it's for everybody. It's not just for certain people. You can allow that magic to come. And you can allow it to come really, really fast when you almost let go of your need to control how it's going to come, the circumstances. Like I said before, it's the universe. The universe will flow through you. It will channel through you. And when you, and, it, and it channels through you when you're of this high vibration. So it serves you very well to be in alignment. Be in alignment. Be in alignment. It's like this triangle. I've learnt this recently, this triangle. Be in alignment, which means basically feeling good, following your passion, following your joy, following your excitement. So so you're in alignment, you're feeling good, you're coming across here, you're a vibrational match to what you want, meaning you feel excited about your desire. And then at the top is synchronicities. These two things will be happening and the synchronicity and then at the top, will be the inspired action that you've got to take through the synchronicities that will come from the universe, from universal intelligence. The universal intelligence is working through you and it's going to bring you that magic of your desire. And, your, and once you've done it a few times, you've got the hang of it, you become skilled at it, you want to do it again and again and again. <laughs> so I'm on this journey with you, you know, and... and at the end of the day, not one person has not got patterns within them from childhood, but we've got to work through the patterns, them, them negative thoughts. We've got to use our mind, our mind power. And you can allow in the magic. It, it's, it's, once it starts working for you, you get, you get the formula, it starts working for you, you'll be amazed, amazed. Magic will be happening in your, in your life. Synchronicities will be happening everywhere. You know, what you've been thinking about, what you've been focusing on, because that is what the law of attraction is about. What you think about, you bring about, like attracts like, thoughts become things. All this is part of the law of attraction. And I encourage you to learn about it and become it. Be, be what you want, be what you're wanting, not act as if, be as if. Be what you want, if you want a relationship. You know, in the day, if you're at home in the day, or even if you're going to work, you could sort, you could like have two cups out, or put some um, put some space in your wardrobe for your soulmate. You know, when he comes home from work, you could have little conversations with him. Be as if, and and like I said, it's how you feel. This is your guidance. It's how you feel as to whether you're on the right path. If it feels good. When you can feel yourself dancing with him in the kitchen, <laughs> which is one of my desires, um, you know, you're on the right path. The universe loves this. The universe loves you being it. You're on a, you're a match to your desire. You're not pushing against it. You're letting go of the outcome. You're letting go of the resistance and your negative patterns about that desire. And it will just come in really, really quick, I assure you. But you've got to practice it. It doesn't just happen like that. The mind is very, very powerful and it's working every single hour of every single day. And you've got to, you've got, you, you know, I haven't got to, but I invite you to take on these principles and, and learn from it. You know, I'm still on this journey. I will be on this journey forevermore because I absolutely love it. I'm passionate about it. And whoever wants to listen, I invite them to be passionate about it. It's a great path to be on.
Anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Um, I'll put a link in the description below about my Simplified Law of Attraction book, It Works. I'll also put a link to my website, Instagram and Facebook page. I hope you have a wonderful day. Blessings to you, my friends. Much love and namaste.